Hello, my name is Onyx. I'm going to show you how I use my iPhone as a gestural controller for my live performances. First, I use a program called Touch OSC. That little icon right down there. So I'm going to hit that. I'm going to turn Touch OSC on. What I do is I use this during my performance. I use the accelerometer to control different stuff. So I can do this, I can do all of these things, and it'll send the data to my computer. So there's the interface that I designed. The first one is uh, just instrument stuff and volume control. The second one is uh, when I have to do, you know, if I want to do some non-accelerometer um, effects processing. This is set up to work with Core 2. I use the preset management that's built into Core so that I can pick any instrument that I want and play it and then this lets me control it with the accelerometer and then this page is all of the um, main controls that I need to have access to at any given time like transposing um, post and pre effects and then volume control and then this XYZ is my it lets me know where my accelerometer is I use a program called pure data and this lets me have access, this lets me take the OSC data and do all kinds of stuff with it. This is my matrix that lets me send um, and receive data back and forth. So that comes in from, uh, from um, Touch OSC and then that's sent all around here to all of the various uh, controls and then it's sent back over here and I can send it back out to Touch OSC. So now that this is on, you can see for instance, if I want, I can I hit that, then all of a sudden you see the numbers start to move. Right? Same thing with the uh, with the X axis and the Z axis is when you turn it upside down. So that gives so that lets me know exactly where everything is. And I have a switch set on mine so that when I do this, when that green light comes on, it means that it's turned on a switch that I can use to control stuff. Same thing with the X, same thing with the Z. So I have full control over my system and I get feedback from the system. Now I use my controller, which is for right now a WX5 Win MIDI controller, and I have it in between the controller and the rest of my synths. So if I so to turn on certain effects, I can do it like this. And if you listen, you can hear that it's buzzing. But that turns that on. That turns this on. And because it's uh, because of the way that it's made, if I want to control the volume now, I turn this on, and then I can use the accelerometer to control my volume, which is the middle fader. And that's that, so that I can actually I don't have to actually touch it. Uh, you'll see here also the other one registers lip pressure. So this allows me to control a lot of uh, parameters in a live performance. I put this into what is usually an armband holder, but when I put it here, I have full accelerometer based control of my system. 